Hey guys, what's going on? It's Carl here back with another episode and as back to school season is looming, it's upon us. This is the best back to school laptop that you can get. You can kind of see it lurking in the background. It is none other than the LG Gram, this lightweight contender. And before we get into all of the details, LG is running a massive Share the Art campaign where they're actually giving away 14 LG grams to one of you lucky peeps. It is super simple to enter, simply sub to the channel, leave a comment down below what your fave feature of the gram is. Check me out over on Instagram and the full link, of course, down below. Okay, so back to the back to school goodies. The reason why the LG Gram is so awesome is the most important feature I think for a student is portability. And where this thing gets its name, the Gram, is because it is so light. So I ended up getting the 13 inch model, the one that's under a thousand bucks. This is probably the one that most students will eye. And this thing is so light, it almost feels like a laptop where it's missing a battery, it's missing something. You almost forget that you're carrying it because it's one of the lightest laptops out there, right around two pounds and feels almost like a tablet, but it's a laptop, awesome. So the build on this guy is made out of magnesium alloy, so it's not full metal. It still feels somewhat premium though. It doesn't feel too cheap and plasticky. On the inside, once we get to the actual keystrokes, there's a tad bit of flex on the keyboard, but nothing that will make you over concerned. And over on the screen, which is a touch screen by the way, once again, the flex isn't anything too crazy. And the nice thing for a laptop this light, you can still open it with one hand without any problems. It doesn't shift around, which is super awesome. The trackpad has a nice feel to it. I wish it was a tad bit bigger, but once again, since this is a 13 inch laptop, space is hard to come by. The keyboard is now backlit, which is an improvement over last year. And even though the keystrokes are quite shallow, I still have enjoyed it. Typing on this guy, word processing, surfing the net, no issues on my end. Maybe the one thing that I'd have to say about the design is the camera placement. A bit strange sitting on the hinge, and that's maybe to keep the bezels nice and thin, which the Gram successfully does. And the display on the inside of the bezels is also great to look at, and that's coming from someone that's used the Surface laptop, the Surface Pro, ones with a higher pixel density, still awesome, and I haven't been able to see any pixels on the screen, and everything looks razor sharp. Port-wise, we've got two USB 3.0 ports, one USB-C, an HDMI port, and a proprietary charger, which I'm not too crazy about. Would have preferred to see the charging mechanism via USB-C, but on the plus side, battery life on this guy is once again one of the main reasons why I love this so much. On two or three occasions, I was getting over 10 hours, which for a laptop of this size and of course this weight, that is pretty awesome. And being a student, it is super important that you can go the entire day without charging, no matter how many classes you have. That is key for the student life. Speakers on the side are decent. It will fulfill your multimedia experience, mostly probably watching Netflix, YouTube videos, me. You'll be able to hear me just fine. So internally on this guy, as it is a bit more of a budget-friendly device, we've got an Intel Core i5, Intel HD Graphics 620, eight gigs of RAM, 256 gigs of onboard storage. And for the most part, remember, if you're going back to school, your workflow will probably be word processing, browsing the net, word processing, typing essays, and I get it having 15, 20 tabs open in Chrome. This thing still wouldn't slow down. This thing also handles 1080p footage. If you're looking to edit some photos, maybe though, if you're looking to game, you can get by on low to medium settings on basic titles like Overwatch, Starcraft, but if you wanna push this guy any further, you probably have to look elsewhere. Remember being lightweight, portable, and having an awesome battery are the strengths of this guy. And for being a student, once again, those are the most important things that you'll need when going back to school. So no matter what backpack, sling, purse, bag, whatever you decide to bring your laptop in, the Gram will be able to slide into without any problems as it's the same size and even weight of a lot of tablets out there and we've got a fully functional PC. Nice. Another key feature of the Gram, which I think is great for students is the survivability or I guess durability of this laptop. And I'm not saying to go throw your laptop, but there have been multiple occasions where I've dropped this guy accidentally and it is still in perfect working order 
touchscreen still works and I couldn't really say the same for any drops that I've had on my MacBook Pro behind me, which is maybe triple to quadruple the price. I know you students get up to some pretty weird things. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed my best back to school laptop recommendation. For most students out there, this will check most boxes off. And just remember, LG has a massive campaign going on where they partnered up with artists to create three pieces of art on the features based off of the gram, and you can win one of 14 of these devices. All links and info is listed in the description box. Best of luck to you all. Have a ton of fun when you're heading back to school, and I will catch the rest of you in one of my next episodes or in one of my next vlogs. Peace.